While we were packing our bags, my friend showed us pictures of an amazing place not so far from Ternate. So, instead of going back to Jakarta, we decided to extend our holiday. Good morning guys, back with me Dewi for I Indonesia, where you will see Indonesia from the eyes of the locals. So, from about 20.30 local time and now it is 7.30, we were on the boat to an exotic place which I am sure will take your breath away. Where to? Stay with me. Okay, so from the boat, what we will take is the local transportation, which you can see around me. These are what we call with bentor or becha motor. Let's get one. This island is one of the biggest islands in North Moluccas. It also is very abundant in natural resources. Based on the information from the local people, the name of this place is derived from the word Morotia, which means the living place of the Moro people. Can you guess where we are? Okay, so I haven't told you where we are. We are in Morotai. And right now we're going on this boat. We're going island hopping. So let's go. Okay, so I'm wet all over because of the water. It splashes while you're on the way. So we just arrived at um, Zoom Zoom McArthur Island. What does it have? Let's go. see why this island is called the Zoom Zoom MacArthur Island because this you can see a statue of Douglas MacArthur there is a short description here but by only reading that I don't really get it they say there's a museum in the city of Morotai we'll go there later so that we actually know who he is and what he actually does on this island fall here it's so quiet that I actually think nobody lives here so there's only the statue of the Douglas MacArthur that we saw before and the rest of it is perfect white sandy beach blue ocean it's paradise it's perfectly beautiful we're done with MacArthur Island thank you MacArthur Island and I'm very curious with the other islands that we're going to let's continue our island hopping
Now we have arrived at one of the best beaches in Morotai. This is Dordola Island. So this place was included in the spots of Sail Morotai 2012. Why is this so famous? It's because the sand is actually as white and as soft and smooth like powdered milk. Let's see whether it's true. So they're not joking, look at this. The sand is really that soft and white like powdered milk. Right now I am sitting at Dodola Besar, which means the big Dodola Island. Right behind me there is the small Dodola Island, which is Dodola Kecil. And if the water level of the sea is high, you have to swim there. But as you can see right behind me, the water level is low, so we can actually walk there. Let's go! white powdered milky sand what also amazes me is this this beautiful clear water maybe one of the clearest I've seen here I am at the small Dodola Island or Dodola Kecil and I actually must say that the sand is even better here maybe because when the sea level is high people don't actually swim here since it is super beautiful, it's breezy, I'm going to take a nap. See you later! After having my perfect nap, I now want to lay myself down on this very clear water. Not so far from Dodola Island, we found this island around 10 minutes away. So this is called Kolorai Island. It is a fisherman's village. Let's explore. Unfortunately, when we talk about Morotai, it is not only about abundance, but it is also about scarcity. On this fisherman's village called Kolorai, they are very lacking education facilities. There is only one elementary school and one junior high school and a very low number of educators. So if you want to know more about Kolorai, please search it on the internet and let's give a hand. After asking around, so this island is 180 in width and 270 in length and there are around 90 families living here. We're done with the island hopping and now we're back on the mainland. Follow our journey to know more about MacArthur. I'm standing here in Air Kaca. So this is one of the favorite spots of MacArthur. Yes, the one that we saw before on the island. So this is thus from the Second World War. So it's amazing that it's actually still here. Unfortunately, we didn't have time to go to the museum because it was getting late. But fortunately, we did have time to stop by at the Tricora Monument. Ha <laughs> ha!
For me, what's best about traveling is blending in with the locals. Like these kids here, every afternoon they would come here and jump off and having so much fun. Like me, I had so much fun in Morotai. Thank you very much, Morotai. This is Dewi Fresh and Raisa Rahma for I Indonesia. See you next time.